Welcome to Mike's Computer Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can change the color of your taskbar down the bottom of the screen here without affecting um, any of the other Windows elements. Okay, let's get straight into it. The first thing to do is to go to mikescomputertips.com and then right up here at the moment we have the tutorial up top, but we're going to search for changing color. And there we go, change the color of your Windows 7 taskbar. And like on all the tutorials on Mike's Computer Tips, you can go here to download a handy PDF tutorial. And we'll just load that up quickly. These PDF walkthroughs are very handy because they'll go through in full detail of everything you need and you can even save them to your computer for later use if you ever need them again. So we're going to go through this one today and what you're going to need, basically you're going to need a uh, desktop background that you can Im uh, edit. You're going to need a photo, oh, sorry, a um, image editing suite such as Photoshop or GIMP for example. Um, and you'll need to be using a Windows 7 Aero theme. Alright, so we'll get into editing the image. Right here I've got Photoshop with uh, my image loaded up. And it's quite simple. What we're going to do is, oh, one note worth um, putting down is that uh, you'll want the image that you're editing to be the same size as your current resolution. Uh, for this example, my resolution is 1920 by 1200 pixels, and this image is the same dimensions. Alright, so first thing we want to do is go into the image menu, go into image size, and what we're going to do is we're just going to uh, we get rid of this constrained proportions, we're going to remove 38 pixels from the height of the image. I'm sorry, I want to subtract 38 from 1200, so 1160, oops, not 8, 62. There we go. So that'll reduce the size of the image slightly. But then what we're going to do is we're going to go into image canvas size. I'm going to click on this top square here, which means because what we're going to do is we are going to re-add those 38 pixels and by selecting this top middle box here it means we're going to grow the, these new pixels out of the bottom of the image as such. And what you can do there is you can then get your uh, selection tool, you can go up to style fixed size, and make it the width of our image, in this case 1900, make the height 38, and then we can just click and automatically, not 1900, minus 1920, that'll automatically make it the size of the uh, area we want to edit for the um, back, oh, the uh, taskbar change, and we just simply go to the colour window over here, and we just select whichever colour we want to replace it with. Hit OK. And fill. In this case I'm using Alt Backspace to fill primary colour. And there we go. Now we just save this image as. We'll just save as. A JPEG will do. Rename it in case you don't want to overwrite the original. There we go. Make As it's a background and we're not putting it on the internet, it doesn't matter how big the file is really, so nice full quality image right there. And then we simply bring up the uh, folder that the image is in, right click on it, set as desktop background, and as you can see, we've got a nice red taskbar down the bottom of the screen now. And there you go. And that's it. And just remember if you need any other tips, P 
PC or Mac, just go ahead and go straight to mycecomputertips.com. See you later.